get you a saddle, huh? You silly boy. I think it's missing. I don't know. Are you supposed to put like a toy in here? This is so neat. I just want all the money so I can spoil my animals. Eesh. Yeah. All the money. <clears throat> this would get so dirty so fast. Aloon actually doesn't need more clothes. It's crazy. She has a wardrobe. Okay, in editing this video, um, this seemed like the perfect opportunity to show you this that I have recently hello, that I've recently done. This is probably the only time that I will talk about it, but I went through a very serious breakup this year. Nothing dramatic. I mean, horrible, but uh, agreeable. It's weird. Anyways, uh, that's it. And I'm only saying it as an introduction to the fact that this closet in my master bedroom as like a new chapter type thing, I changed it from a closet that was uh, dedicated to this individual to a closet that is dedicated to my dog clothes. <laughs> I'm gonna be single forever. It's my dog clothes closet. Which is <laughs> totally normal. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So she, there's a lot of clothes. It's not just for her. I have a lot of small dogs and pigs and it's been an accumulation of gifts and years of acquiring these things, but nonetheless, it's enough to warrant its own closet, so. Also, like, childhood Adri dreams come true. Closet of dog clothes. And these are, like, stacked. Oh, I shouldn't even show you this. It's embarrassing. These are stacked, like, several layers high. Of course, some of you probably recognize <laughs> the clothes because people have sent so many. She is a very spoiled and loved little girl. So, yeah, there's... These are not just, like one layer deep here and even these um yeah so anyways back to the video where we are looking around tj maxx i believe i believe it's gonna be tj maxx possibly even michael's christmas i just said she doesn't need more christmas night jammies <laughs> pj christmas eve jammies this is so smaller. Nice. This is pretty nice. It's even cheese. This is softer than human oh. stuff. Mm. Oh, that's like hard too. Yeah, I'm telling you, this is just the beginning. So many pillows. Gnomes? Yep. I'm not that obsessed with gnomes, okay? <laughs> That's Santa. Why? He's a hundred dollars. He comes with this whole thing. Oh. Well, I mean, that's still... I wonder what it compares. I would that. never, but so. There's that a hundred and fifty. Oh, oh, dear. Packed. It's like hard to move. I don't want to leave the cart, though, because last time we did, someone just wiped it. But I also can't navigate safely. I think I'll break stuff. There's some, here's a vintage thing, it's a set. What's supposed to be, oh I see. Yeah. Oh, these are so cute. It's snowing. Yeah, that's what I see in all of the home decorating videos is the black stuff is so pretty until you look at your floor. Love these signs, they light up. Okay, how much are you? I like this one, the blue one, I think. With the green. Uh, $24.99. Huh. Oh, I like that, that one there, too. Which one? The one behind it, that green one. Oh, the Christmas tree. I can make that. I have um, a silhouette, the cameo thing. And I just always forget. Oh, I like that snowflake.
too. Yeesh. Overpriced candles. I'm just always shocked how many people I see buy the candles here and like think that it's such a great deal. I love the smell. Like, oh, I'm not a floral scented at all. I'm a very like yeah, dark and woods smell, but like $7.99. Telling you the oldie ones, the three wick for $3.99, the best thing ever. I guess when you compare it to like Bath and Body Works prices, $25 for a candle. Sure. I feel like they're already done with stuff. I don't have any of it, but I know a lot of people do. 